You've probably seen cats, dogs, and birds, but what about a fish with a transparent head, a lizard with a blue tongue, or a wasp that creates zombies? In this video, we'll show you 15 of the most unusual animals on the planet. The Giant Anteater Giant anteaters are the largest of the four anteater species, with lengths of 6 to 8 feet and weights of 33 to 50 kilograms for males and 27 to 47 kilograms for females. They have an elongated snout, a two-foot-long tongue, long four claws, and a bushy tail. Native to Central and South America, they live in multiple habitats, including grassland and rainforest. They feed on termites and ants, which they slurp up with their sticky saliva and avoid overexploiting their food supply by revisiting many insect colonies. They're also surprisingly good swimmers. Giant anteaters have been around for about 25 million years. They can flick their tongues in and out of their mouths up to 150 times a minute. They'll eat around 35,000 ants and termites a day, which is about 1 million a month. That's like the entire population of Austin, Texas, or Dublin, Ireland, being eaten by a single creature every month. Star-Nosed Mole The Star-Nosed Mole is a small mammal that lives in wet lowland areas of North America. It gets its name from its unique nose that's shaped like a star and has 22 fleshy appendages called rays. And though it can smell, that's not its primary use. The mole uses this weirdly shaped appendage to feel its way around and hunt prey in the dark. Its star is the most sensitive touch organ known in any mammal with more than 100,000 nerve fibers. That's five times the number of touch fibers in a human head. The star-nosed mole can even smell underwater by blowing air bubbles and sucking them back into its nose. It's one of only two animals in the world that can do this. Pretty cool, right? Bat-Eared Fox Gallivanting on the plains of eastern and southern Africa is the bat-eared fox, so named for its comically large ears that it can be up to five inches long, and those large ears are not all for show. They're so sensitive, this fox can actually listen for the tiniest movements of termites and insects to eat. The bat-eared fox is ash gray in color, with black-tipped ears, black legs, and tail. It has 48 teeth, which is more than most mammals. And instead of drinking water, the bat-eared fox gets most of its moisture from its food. That's a survivalist. It's also deceivingly fast. In fact, it can even outrun lions and cheetahs, running at speeds faster than 70 miles an hour. The Colugo The Colugo is a fascinating mammal native to southeastern Asia. It's also known as the flying lemur, but it's not exactly a lemur and it doesn't fly. Instead, it glides between trees using a special membrane called a patagium. Also, even though they're called flying lemurs, they're actually more closely related to primates. Colugos are the best gliders of all gliding mammals and can glide up to 200 meters between trees. There's two species of colugos, the Sunda flying lemur and the Philippine flying lemur. They're nocturnal and live in trees and have big eyes for great vision and small rounded ears, which are perfect for gliding around at night while on the lookout for their next meal. This consists of leaves, buds, flowers, and occasionally fruits. The Blue Tongue Skink did you know there's a lizard with a blue tongue? It's called the Blue Tongue Skink, and it's native to Australia and New Guinea. When it feels threatened, it can stick out its blue tongue as a warning to potential enemies. The Blue Tongue Skink has thick silvery scales with dark bands or bars, and its colors can vary. It has a sturdy body with a large head, small and short legs, and a flattened notched tongue. It uses its powerful bite to eat snails and other prey. One of the most amazing things about the Blue Tongue Skink is that females give birth to live young. They have eggs inside of them that hatch before they give birth, and they're also super smart and are considered one of the most intelligent pet lizards around. The Hagfish The hagfish is a unique and fascinating creature. It's a jawless, eel-like marine fish that can be found in depths of up to 3,300 feet. What makes it truly unique is that it's the only animal that has a skull but no spinal column, although it does have some basic vertebrae. It even has the ability to absorb nutrients through its skin. But perhaps the most amazing thing about the hagfish is its ability to produce slime. This slime allows it to escape capture by tying itself into an overhand knot. It also clogs up the gills of marine predators, suffocating them so they'll release the hagfish. Despite being called a slime eel, it's not actually an eel, but rather a species of ancient jawless fish. In other words, these guys have been slamming it up for millions of years. The Bobbit Worm Get ready to be amazed by the Bobbit Worm, also known as the Sand Striker. This fascinating creature, scientifically known as Eunice Aphroditios, can grow to be nearly 10 feet long. In fact, one such worm was discovered living within an aquaculture raft in Shirarima, Japan in 2009. These worms have been around for at least 20 million years, with some dens remaining preserved in the fossil record, including a 20 million year old lair in Taiwan. 
Bobby worms build mucus lined burrows in the seafloor and hunt by Amish and Cray with their sandy burrows. Despite being practically blind, they use their antennae to sense their prey. They're omnivores that feed on small fish and other worms, as well as detritus, seaweed, and other microalgae. The Saiga Antelope this critically endangered antelope once roamed a vast area of the Eurasian steppe, but it's been greatly reduced by hunting and habitat destruction. Now, it can only be found in locations in southwestern Russia, Kazakhstan, and Mongolia. Saga antelopes have a head and body length of between 3 and 5.6 feet and can weigh between 57 and 152 pounds. Their most outstanding feature is their swollen snout with downward directed nostrils. This weird appendage makes the animal look like it wants to transform into an elephant, but change its mind midway. The snout serves to warm and moisten inhaled air and may be related to the animal's keen sense of smell. It may also work as a sounding chamber for running calls. The Barrel Eye Fish Get ready to dive deep into the world of the Barrel Eye Fish, also known as the Spook Fish. This small deep sea fish is truly amazing with a dome-shaped transparent head that contains glowing green eyes. Found in tropical to temperate waters of the Atlantic, Pacific, and Indian Oceans, there's only been a handful of sightings of this fish. Their alien-like heads are made up of a transparent shield and fluid that protects their eyes. Through the transparent dome, you can see their eyes, brain, and nerve endings in their head. Normally, their eyes point upwards to capture as much light as possible, but barrel eyes are capable of rotating these eyes forward, searching for prey. This unique adaptation allows them to search for food in the dark depths of the ocean. The Kiwa Crab the Kiwa Crab is a marine decapod that inhabits hydrothermal vents and cold seeps at deep sea levels. They are a relatively new animal species, only having been first discovered in 2005 just off the coast of Easter Island. Its hairy and bristly appearance has earned it the nicknames of Yeti Crab, Yeti Lobster, or Furry Lobster. But instead of using these arms and claws to catch prey, they have a very unique and unbelievable purpose. These tiny crabs farm their own food on their hairy arms, capturing all kinds of bacteria that live and grow to them. To encourage growth, they've been seen waving their arms back and forth in sweeping vents. This unique adaptation allows them to survive in harsh conditions of the deep sea. Their deep sea habitat has had such an impact on their development, hence they have no color pigment whatsoever and are completely blind. The Barbarossa The Barbarossa, also known as the deer pig, is one of the most fascinating creatures on the planet. Found on the Indonesian island of Sulawesi, this member of the pig family is sometimes referred to as a prehistoric pig, due to its stocky body and curved teeth. Male babarusas are particularly notable for their long upper canines that grow vertically from their gums, piercing through their skin and curve back over their faces towards their foreheads. Despite their fierce appearance, these tusks don't seem to cause any pain to the babarusa, well, for the most part. There have been cases when these tusks grew so long they pierced right through the animal's head. As you can imagine, that's worse than the worst migraine. In contrast, female babarusas don't have the large tusks that males are famous for. If they do grow tusks, they're usually small and don't protrude through their snouts. These unique characteristics make the babarusa a truly remarkable animal. The Venezuelan Poodle Moth The Venezuelan Poodle Moth is a mysterious and fascinating creature that's sure to capture your imagination. Discovered in 2009 in Venezuela by a zoologist named Dr. Arthur Anker, this moth is known for its unique appearance, resembling a poodle with its fluffy white body, big black eyes, and long brown antennae. It belongs to the Lasiocapidae family of moths, which boasts over 2,000 different species. But despite its popularity, not much is known about this enigmatic insect. With only one photo in existence and its taxonomy yet to be established, the Venezuelan poodle moth remains shrouded in mystery. But that just adds to its intrigue, don't you think? Naked Mole Rat Found in parts of Eastern Africa, the Naked Mole Rat has some unique characteristics that make it highly resilient. For example, it can survive almost an hour in low oxygen conditions by using fructose to power energy production. Scientists are studying this ability to find new treatments for stroke patients. But that's not all. Naked Mole Rats also seem to defy aging and appear immune to cancer. Their immunity to aging is due to unique protective mechanisms that safeguard against DNA damage caused by mutations due to oxidative stress. Scientists believe that these creatures may hold the key to preventing the treating age-related conditions such as cancer, dementia, or Parkinson's disease. Pretty amazing, right? The Hairy Frogfish Meet the Hairy Frogfish, a fish with a face that even its own mother would find difficult to love. 
This creature has a rounded body covered in spines that resembles hairs. Not only is it ugly, it's also a voracious eater. It can even swallow prey as large as itself, and don't even get me started on the creepy way it walks on the ocean floor. And if you think you're antisocial, you don't even hold a candle to this fish, preferring to be alone most of the time, often acting violently against company. During mating season, they gather together, but after fertilization, it's back to being an angry hermit. The Dementor Wasp Native to Thailand, this wasp has red and black coloring and preys on cockroaches to incubate their eggs and feed. The wasp will sting a cockroach on the head, releasing a toxin that goes directly to the neural nodes. These toxins act as a blocker to the octopomene receptors of the cockroach, leaving it alive but unable to control its own movements. In other words, this moth has mastered the art of mind control. The cockroach will then run into its wasp nest, as if directed to do so. The female Dementor wasp then injects her eggs into the cockroach, and the larvae feed on the still-living cockroach from the inside out. For that disturbing fact, see you all next time.